السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ میں نے اس جنیا اوت نے بخش طیب الوجود رضی اللہ تعالی نے مدرسہ سے پرس میں تھا کہ اس دے اس ان امپورٹنس اف ام فیت دا امپورٹنس اف فیت مدرسہ سے پرس ام فیت از ان ایمان از ویری ویری امپورٹنٹ ان لائف اف مان کائنڈ ام ات فورس او لائک ٹو ام start with the um, prayer of Tibilan Kirtan Rajum, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, Alhamdulillah Rabbi Alamin, Ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, Maliki Yawmidin, Niya Kanabri wa Ya Samastain, Eidina Surat al-Mustakim, Surat al-Lazina al-Amta alayhim, Jair al-Mazdubi alayhim, Waladdu alayhim, Amin. Rabbi Shura al-Sudi wa Yasir al-Hamari, Wa Ala al-Hamzata min Lisani, Yafqo Kauli, I greet you with the best greeting, Assalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Like I said earlier, my topic today is importance of um, faith, Iman. It helps you in the time, you know, of um, problem. Like, um, at first, let's go into details what faith is. Faith is believing in unseen, believing in the unseen, believing in um, what you cannot see, what you can feel. Because really, we cannot see Allah, we cannot lie to Allah, but we can feel the presence of Allah. Analyze Allah. Mostly when they are reciting Quran, you know, when you're praying with your full, you know, concentration and all that, you know, but you can only feel Allah, you know, really. You cannot see Allah. So, believing in um, Allah, to analyze Allah, believing in um, Allah, that is um, faith, you know, and it's um, number one pillar of um, Islam to be a Muslim. Faith is very, very important. Then number two, it helps you in the time of um, problem, you know, when there's a um, problem, you know that God is with you. Like it said in the early Quran, you know, if um, um, God is always, you know, with um, the believers, God will always be with you, you know, God will never leave you, you know. If you have faith that God is with you, then God is with you. Like Allah says, um, he say um, in the hadith of um, Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam that I am what my um, what my um, what people think I am. You know, like so if you think God is um, very very close to you, then God is close to you. If you think God is far away from you, then God is far away from you. Anyway, that's not where I'm going. So really, it's um, believing in God. You know, believing in um, the the believing in um, believing in God, believing the, in in the existence of God, you know, believing, having faith in everything that Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala creates everything. That is the first of it. Then it will help your faith. Then number two is um, faith is the pillar of your house. Like um, it's not house as in where you live, you know, the pillar of um, house, your body, you know, pillar of your body, pillar of your life, you know. It's really faith is right in the you know in your heart so if you if you have the faith there you know whenever there's um anything or there's um, a problem or anything you know that god is with you that allah swanalai Allah has brought this to you and allah swanalai Allah knows about it and is going to take it away from you you know and um, god will surely do um because the um, problem is a way of um trial you know god having need to know the true believer because we all say we believe in Allah, we believe in Allah. The only way Allah can um, you know, know the true believer is, you know, through trial. You know, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help us during the time of um, trial. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help us to pass. Then when it, um when life is good for you as well, faith helps you to remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, it helps you to give thanks, it helps you to to give glory to Allah and maybe when you're going somewhere, you know, faith helps you, you know, you know, with your um with um religion and all that, you know, to practice your religion, to do everything, you know, faith is um going to help you in that part. Then you'll be able to give thanks, you know, to Allah Swana Life Allah in good thanks as well and be able to remember Allah and do what Allah will. Then number two, faith um um, then the next one, faith helps you to be close to God. You know, really, it helps you to be close to God. It helps you to, um, you know, to to feel God most of the time. You know, because um, 
when you have faith in something, it will, it will help you to keep doing things. Like um, maybe if you love someone, you know, let me just put it that way, for example. I'm not saying faith means love, you know, but what I'm saying is when you love someone, you know, you try you try to do what the person likes. You know, so really that is um, what I really mean, you know, by saying faith helps you, you know, to be close to God. And you and the last one like allow become one. If you do good deeds, you perform this a lot, you do all the things you're supposed to do. Then and also it helps you, you know, to believe in everything, in the, uh, to believe that everything is in the hands of Allah, Manalah Allah. You know, because um, even if you are trying to get uh, and get something and you're not able to get it, you have faith in Allah, Manalah Allah that maybe time is not right for you to get that thing, or maybe Allah will for something better for you. You know, because um, Allah's will will always definitely come to pass. You know, because um, Allah is the supreme controller of everything. And, and the next one is, um, without um, faith, you cannot live your dream. You know, we all have dreams, we all have our dreams in life, what we want to, what we want to become, you know, what we want, our aims, you know, our wish, and all that, you know, but really, whatever Allah wills, will surely come to pass. We all just um, think, you know, we all have um, our goals and all that, that we want to, you know, get, you know, may Allah to analyze Allah help us and make it easy for us. You know, but without faith, you know, we, we can't we can't get there. You know, because sometimes, you know, um, some things come. You know, things come up when you maybe if you love to do some business now and you've already started it, and some trial came. You know, you might think, oh, I can't. Um, you know, maybe um, the, maybe I can't do it anymore and all that. You nearly give up. But with faith. With faith in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that Allah is with you and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is going to help you out of the situation. You know, with that faith it will help you to carry on. You won't give up at all. So the only way to live your dream is with faith. Then the next one is when you have faith in God, you know, there's no fear for you. There's no fear of anything. There's no fear. Even if you want to do something and you're saying, you know, I don't have the money now. With faith in God, you know, God will surely help you out. You know, I'm not saying money is going to come down from you from heaven. Money won't come down from heaven and then money won't come to you inside the house. But Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will open the door for you. We show you the way, you know, where you go through that um will lead you to where the um to lead you to where you can get um what you want to get. And um then the next one is um faith kills the spirit of fear. The spirit of fear that leads in mankind, you know. Maybe they say something is happening somewhere or, or another or something is going to happen. You know, I'm just saying for example, you know, but um, instead of you to be to be panicked or to be afraid, you know, all you need to do is just do your ablution and um, do some prayer, you know. You know, you do some prayer, you, you call Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and um, explain everything. Allah is the all knower, the all seer. Before you say it, Allah knows anyway, but um, it's good to say it again. You say it again, you say what the problem is, and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will help you. By the time you finish um, the prayer, my brothers and sisters, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will send the angels, and they will, they will come to you with al sakina You know, which will calm you down, you will be calm, relaxed, you know, you won't even be afraid. You won't even think about um, the problem anymore, you know. Very, 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 very good. The, uh, the tranquility will come down, you know. It will come down to you, you know, from from from, from Allah. It's only Allah Subhanahu wa Taala that can grant you al sakina. You cannot make it by yourself. You know. It's only Allah Subhanahu wa Taala that can grant you this, you know. And when it comes down, you know, you feel relaxed, you be calm, and you be happy. You know, even the situation you were in before you started your prayer, before you. You give everything up to God, my brothers and sisters, it will be all gone. You know, there's no fear anymore. You know that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is with you. There's no fear. There's nothing to fear when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is there for you. So, my brothers and sisters, let us put our, our, our trust, everything in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because there's nothing we can do. La hawla wa la quwata illa billahi la ali la azim. There's nothing, nothing. There's no strength, there's no power, there's nothing except. With the power of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Whatever Allah wills for us, we have to know this, we must know this. It's very important that whatever Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wills for us, nobody can change it. 
Nobody can change um, what Allah's one like Allah will, because it's Allah, the, 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 the supreme controller, the one in charge of everything. The only thing that can increase your faith, um, your faith that can help you to increase your faith is Surah of Asia, and you can check um, if you um, search um, Aja one month, Aja um, Aja one month. I have um, on YouTube. I I have one that um, on the, I made a video that have that explains to you about how you can improve, you know, increase in your faith in as in your iman. So my brothers and sisters, the only thing that can help us is um, you you do zikir most of the time. Engage yourself in the remembrance of Allah. Engage yourself in good things. All the things we know that Allah wants, Allah, Allah wants, you know. And if you don't know, you can read the Quran or find out, you know, from the scholars. You know what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wants, you know, from us, which is, you know, so last good deed and all that. You find out all that. When you know all that, you keep doing all that, my brothers and sisters, it will help you increase your faith. I thank you very much for listening to me. You know, find out it will help you increase your faith. I thank you for listening to me once again. My name is Jamia. I will today when Sheikh Sayyid Al-Wajid, Rodi Allah, Salaam alaikum.